so this is again for that call up team that uh, didn't get a lot of points all year and I never got called out again after this game so that might tell you something I think here is they had five players so the other team only had five players and we lost three nothing and I didn't even play that bad like the first goal it was like a two on oh it wasn't really two on oh but there's two guys directly going at the net who don't have anyone on them and the guy chips it over my glove the second goal was I made a really nice save I think I made the rebound save and then a the trailer is just all open in front of the net with no one on there. They have five skaters. They never got off the ice. That can't happen ever. And that's what happened. And then the third goal, I screwed up. The puck was, I'm pretty sure, going wide and I hit it in. Just totally whiffed it. Again, bad idea switching glove breaks all the time. But I do because I like doing reviews. And I like trying new things. But this is a good example of where you think something is going to be at your glove. And the glove is different than what you're used to. And it, whoops. But it didn't matter because we didn't score a goal. And that, yeah, that's the thing. The other thing is this game ended with kind of a bench brawl. And I say bench brawl because they don't really have anyone on the bench anyway. So they can't add people to the fight. But our guys definitely came off the bench to add to the fight. So that was the thing. Yeah, it got really dumb. And again, I didn't get asked out again by this team. So we'll see if I get asked out this year if they're ever missing someone. So if you're buying hockey equipment and you want to support the channel, check out the links in the description. In the US, check out the links to Pure Hockey. In Canada, check out the links to Hockey Supremacy. If you click those links and make a purchase, I get a kickback from the sale. So anything that comes back from that comes right back into the channel so I can make more content and doing like real reviews and stuff. I got buy gear to do a lot of the tests for it. So that costs money and it would be greatly appreciated. Otherwise, if you want to support the channel without buying anything, check out the links in the description to Patreon, buy me a coffee. Everything through there comes again back into the channel so I can make more content and doing real reviews. Y'all ready for
You're watching HockeyReviews.ca